Rule 8. Rule 8. <clears throat> action to avoid collision. Any action taken to avoid collision shall, if the circumstances of the case admit, be positive, made in ample time and with due regard to the observance of good seamanship. Any alteration of course or speed to avoid collision shall, if the circumstances of the case admit, be large enough to be readily apparent to another vessel observing visually or by radar. A succession of small alterations of course or speed should be avoided. If there is sufficient sea room, alteration of course alone may be the most effective action to avoid a close quarters situation provided that it's made in good time, is substantial, and does not result in another close quarters situation. Action taken to avoid collision with another vessel shall be such as to result in passing at a safe distance. The effectiveness of the action shall be carefully checked until the other vessel is finally passed and cleared. <clears throat> if necessary to avoid collision or allow more time to assess the situation, a vessel shall slacken her speed or take all way off by stopping or reversing her means of propulsion. <clears throat> a vessel which, by any of these rules, is required not to impede the passage or safe passage of another vessel shall, when required by the circumstances of the case, take early action to allow sufficient sea room for the safe passage of the other vessel. A vessel required not to impede the passage or safe passage of another vessel is not relieved of this obligation if approaching the other vessel so as to involve risk of collision and shall, when taking action, have full regard to the action which may be required by the rules of this part. A vessel, the passage of which is not to be impeded, remains fully obliged to comply with the rules of this part when the two vessels are approaching one another so as to involve risk of collision. The biggest thing I take from this rule should be positive and made in ample time and an alteration of course or speed to avoid here it is. A succession of small alterations of course or speed should not be used. Mm -hmm. If it's, That's how you run into someone when you're walking down a sidewalk. Uh, 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 yeah. Boom, you run into the person. It's so easy to avoid them. All you had to do was stay still and do nothing. And they would have walked around you. But small alterations of course and speed should be avoided. Make large early and substantial alterations of course and speed. When I come at a, <clears throat> when I'm sailing around, I almost never use a motor, right? And I see uh, someone trolling in a powerboat. This is a case where I cross ahead. You don't wanna cross behind someone trolling, right? I'm usually going faster than them. I'm more maneuverable. And I cross ahead, but when I come up to them, if I want to cross them close, I'll show them one side of my vessel, say, big turn, and then slowly kind of bring it, uh -oh. and mm -hmm. pass, not at a dangerous distance, but a little close, say hello, and they appreciate it, because you give them a large and substantial course change, they know what you're doing, and then you can kind of come up into the wind and cross ahead of them, and they're not nervous they they know they they saw what you're doing you made a large and early and substantial change of course and showed them okay and if there's sufficient sea room alteration of course alone may be your best action